Hello world and welcome to part two of improving life and feeling better about yourself. So, for this segment, I'm just going to announce that, yeah, I'm going to teach you more about how to feel better and improve your life. So, to start off, let's talk about your diet because we all know that most people are obese because of depression and that obesity leads to more depression and let's put it this way. If you could fix your diet, your diet actually does control how your emotions work. It also controls how your stomach works. So in the end, your diet will make you happier and skinnier at the same time. So basically healthy eating. Healthy eating will definitely help you guys with your depression. So basically, if you're feeling upset, eat an apple. Because let's be honest, most of the world likes apples. So just eat an apple. And basically, yeah, fruits, just try to stay away from the ones that have too much sugar in them because then you'll get hung up on it and you'll just want to eat 20 of them because I know that happens to me. I could eat an entire pineapple like this big, but if I do that, I'll eat 10 of them. So, yeah, try to keep that in moderation. Now, second for today will be hugs. Everyone knows that they love how they feel after a hug. So basically a hug that lasts for more than five seconds triggers your body into feeling happy for chemical reasons, let's put it that way. So basically if you've got friends, hug them. If you got a little kid that you like to play around with, like your cousin or something, give him a big old hug. Because he's going to be happy. He's definitely going to hug you back because kids always hug back for some unknown reason. Probably because they love you, but yeah. So, hugs are definitely the easiest way to feel better about yourself and to feel happy. So, next up would be pets. If you've got a pet, play with it, damn it. Everyone loves to play with a cat, a dog. Hell, I wish I had a pet monkey. He'll fling poo at me, I'll throw tennis balls back. Of course, he's going to catch them because otherwise it's animal abuse. But yeah, pets are awesome. Think about it this way. Just looking at a pet that's cute will make you happy. So get like a little pet skunk. Remove the stink sack, otherwise you're going to be upset. So get like a little pet skunk or a Pomeranian, the world's fluffiest fucking dog. Because... That thing is just fucking adorable. Or you could even get yourself a little hedgehog, which is probably the size of my palm. But yeah, they will all make you happy, always. You guys will definitely enjoy it. Now, this is something that I know everyone has in their house, whether you like to admit it or not. Grab a stuffed animal. Yeah, it sounds absurd, but stuffed animals do help people get over depression they do help people smile. They will help you in life because a stuffed animal is something that, sure, it's an inanimate object, but we all know that you tell it all your deepest, darkest secrets. So it's your best friend. It's not in my case. I have stuffed animals, yes. Do I have them with me currently? No. But I do have my favorite pillow, which I do cuddle with at night because, hell, it's Luffy. I don't care what you guys say. I'm straight. It's Luffy. I love One Piece. So, yeah. Best pillow in the world. I'm so lucky I found it. <laughs> so, yeah, guys. Basically, stuffed animals are going to make your life so much better, whether you like to admit it or not. And my last tip for you guys today is last week you guys should have been practicing my phrase up until this Wednesday. You should be practicing the phrase I told you last week. So, for the next week, I want you to continue practicing the phrase I told you last week, but I also want you guys to try that healthy eating thing. If you guys could succeed with this, eventually, I'm going to have you guys set up so you'll be able to, basically, it'll be second nature to you guys. So, out of all of these videos, I'm going to give you bits and pieces of how to improve your life slowly. So, if you continue using these bits and pieces, 
your life will be so much, you'll be happier in life, and your life might actually become simpler for you to live. So, I hope you guys do tune in, listen, and try out all these different little nooks and crannies that I'm giving you to become happier, healthier people. Because I really don't care. I'm doing this because I want to help you guys. That's the only reason. Otherwise, I could care less about being on camera right now because I hate being on camera. I really do. <laughs> but I want to become a YouTuber to help people. That's the only reason. So <laughs> that's all I got to say for this week, guys. Tune in next week for part three. Goodbye, world.